Hey guys, what is up? Gerald here and welcome to another video. Today we are back again with another one on Assassin's Creed Valhalla because we have gotten some really promising information and huge news. So first of all, a huge shout out to your Raptor for sharing this information and with that being said, let's get into the details. So in a recent interview of your Raptor with the post-launch producer at Ubisoft, Jose Ariasa confirmed that we are getting another awesome outfit in Assassin's Creed Valhalla. And that, as he stated, it is coming sooner than we think. And currently, we already have two legacy outfits in Valhalla, being Bayek's outfit from Assassin's Creed Origins and the one and only outfit of the first assassin, Altair. But in the interview, Ubisoft confirmed that a highly requested outfit will make its way to Valhalla pretty soon. And I am talking about the Hidden Ones robes of Basim and Hytham, two characters who by now we all know in Assassin's Creed Valhalla. From the launch of the game on, people including myself were already requesting it and hoping that it one day would be added to the game. And adding it to the game only makes sense, because the only real thing that the game is missing is a real Hidden Ones outfit. And not an outfit from another game such as Origins, Black Flag, Brotherhood or Revelations. Although these would be fire if they were one day added to the game. But an outfit that fits the setting, the era and the atmosphere. And at least in my opinion, I do think that Basim's Hidden Ones robes are the perfect fit for this, because it just matches with what is already in the game and what members of the Hidden Ones were wearing around that point in time. I also just did not really understand why it wasn't already in the game, because let's be honest, we received the signature blades from the two Hidden Ones in the game, but did not really get a signature outfit to go along with it. And to be honest, this was a bit bothering to me. But that this outfit finally will be added to the game is really huge and actually great news because it means that Ubisoft is listening to the feedback of the Assassin's Creed community and that they are in fact acting on it. But the most awesome thing may be that we will get this awesome new outfit in the near future as Jose states that it will come sooner than you think when answering YouTube or your Raptor when he asked about the outfit in a recent interview. And that it will come very soon is once again confirmed by various sources who have already found files in Assassin's Creed Valhalla on PC that included the outfit. So what I am expecting is that it will either be included in the next update or that it will be available after the weekly reset of next week, possibly via the Ubisoft Connect platform as we have already seen with Bayek's outfit and the gift pack from Ubisoft containing Altair's outfit. I will of course keep you guys updated when we have more information. And when talking about information, the interview of your Raptor provided another huge announcement, which is that one-handed swords will finally be coming to the game. And this is very big news, since I am personally a really big fan of one-handed swords, as it were my favorites in both Assassin's Creed Origins and Odyssey. So I was really missing it in Valhalla. Especially since we were finally be able to play with one-handed weapons and equip a shield. Something that was non-existent in Odyssey. And on top of that, again, I do not really understand why they weren't in the game in the first place. But as well as with the outfit of Basim and Hytham, one-handed swords were the most requested items to be added to the game. And heck yeah, Ubisoft listened to this request. I do have to add to this that we are not going to see this being added to the game as fast as the Basim outfit. Because as Jose explained, they have to add a whole new weapon type to the game with unique finishers that feels unique and that fits in the current system of the game. So it will take some more time, but the great thing is that we at least already know that it is coming. And honestly, I can't wait what more they got in store for us with this game. Because besides all the bullcrap and the Helix store fiasco, I do really enjoy this game and its setting. Also that the game will get a bigger post-launch support than Odyssey means that they are really committing to this game and that they want to change it for the better. And I am also really looking forward to the first DLC that will be coming to the game at the end of April. I will of course be covering that as well right here on the channel. So we already have reached the end of the video. If you are excited for the new content coming to Assassin's Creed Valhalla, let me know by leaving a like. And what do you think has to be added in the game as well? Let me know in the comments down below. And for more Assassin's Creed Valhalla content, make sure to subscribe to the channel. And as always, thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one.